Hey, this is Noah Crosby of Mandalay Music, and uh, whether you know it or not, depends on when you look at these videos. Uh, this is actually the third video I'm doing today in a kind of a series of looking at vintage instruments and repairing one of my own personal instruments and actually putting a new top on it. This is an interesting instrument because this is a D1218 from 1972. 12 fret to the body, 12 string guitar, which I had actually repaired uh, about 24 or 25 years ago. I had owned it, repaired it, and sold it. It came to me with a hole in the back. This is not necessarily one of my prettiest repairs, but decided to do this kind of thing here on the back. Literally had a hole and uh, kind of did a little design here, a little violin-like. Um, how much you can see inside. What I don't remember is, and what I'm doing with it this time, is doing a neck reset, which we've done a couple of neck reset videos recently. Um, has some interesting things too. Not sure what these holes here are some sort of production things. I don't remember seeing that on this era of guitars before, but that doesn't mean they didn't do it. So uh, pretty much this is a straight ahead neck reset, but you know, these, these 12 fret to the body Martins were very interesting because I think that they were more stable and better sounding 12 string than the later ones. 12 strings at this particular moment in time are not super popular, though I have lately both repaired and sold a couple of 12 string guitars, including a 1973 Martin D1235. So this guy is interesting. Um, it's probably got the bridge here is probably some of the last Brazilian that they use for such stuff. So the fingerboard could be Brazilian, it could be could be Indian. It's hard to say. It looks more like Indian, though the the bridge definitely looks more Brazilian. I don't know how well you can see that. You know, I have our opinions about that. But uh, I'll I'll give you a quick video of this when I finish it. So yeah, it comes out. You want to get some more neck angle. It's got a very, very low saddle on this. Not the lowest, but it's pretty low. So I'd like to get it a little more saddle height and not have to shave the bridge. Um, it would be nice to get this tone. But this friend of mine bought this for me. I decided I wasn't at that particular time. I wasn't going to play it, so I'm not like a big collecting collector kind of always guy but he's had this for almost 25 years and didn't have any issues with it until quite recently the next door to the lift so I think that's pretty good for repairs and uh, for someone I think I think it dries his house out a little bit um, but anyway that's what's going on with this guy and uh, we'll let you see the results of this down the road. Take care and happy Thanksgiving. Bye.